Hey everyone, so in this video, I'll be showing you guys um, how to get to Knockcon Internal City as well as the full clear of Knockcon Internal City. So, right here, after you defeated um, General Redan at Redmain Castle, you can proceed um, to the side of Grace called um, Fort Height, Fort Height West. Let me. <laughs> Just find where it is. Can't really recall. Ah, here it is. Yep, Fort Hyde West. Yep, from here, um, there'll be a new area unlocked after we defeated General Dan. Yeah, so this new area is pretty um, obvious. Yep, once you're here, you can just um, well on Torrent. Yeah, and from here, uh, you will want to. Head west. Yep. Um. Sorry for that cut, guys. Yep. So, head west, and you see these floating rocks in the sky. Yep. This area will be unlocked uh, once you defeated General Dan. So we need to make our way down. Yeah. This is actually my first time. <laughs> so let me just figure out. How do we get down there? Whoa. Uh, doesn't seem to be that way. I think this should be the way down. Um, let's head right. Hold on, let me just see. Okay, yep, yep. Um, the path on the right will lead us down. I hope. <laughs> yeah, so I did a bit of research. Yeah, but I never actually um, done this before. Yeah, but all good. Yep, this seems to be. The right way. Let me see if just if there's anything here. All right. Man, this seems like a very high jump. All right. Seems like we can't ride on torrent from here on. Yeah, the blue, this blue glow actually means that you can't write torrent in. Hopefully this is the right way. Yeah, so actually um, in Nokron internal city, uh, you also can get the Mimic Ashes of War Yep, the Mimic tier Ashes of War It's one of the strongest Ashes of War here I mean in Elden Ring Yep, so Really looking forward to that Huh Let me just figure out Where do we go from here Yeah, I think the only way is to go down Yeah, this place is really foggy. Let me just turn on my lantern. Yeah, so much better now. <laughs> yeah, I don't really like the fog in Elden Ring. Yeah, apparently there's a lot of fog in many places. Yeah, it's really blurry. Yep, so I always carry a lantern around. Which makes things much more visible yeah, let me see if I can yep there mine mm, doesn't seem to have anything much here okay, I see an item down there a sophorific grease hope I'm pronouncing that correctly <laughs> Oh, 
nice. Alright. Yep. Here we are at Nocron Eternal City. Man, this place looks awesome. A new adventure awaits. Yep, right from the start, seems like um, this is going to be quite a challenging place. <laughs> yeah, we already have to work on such short pathways. Ooh, what's that? Ah, seems like there's a black gooey monster down there. Alright, so far so good. Oh, there's one more down there. Whoa! Man, that just pierced through my heart. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of him. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh man. Okay, okay. That was a rather note mistake. <laughs> Alright, um, let me just run back real quick. Yep, so, um, sorry for the weird cut. Yep, um, we are back here again. Ignore my no mistake earlier. <laughs> yeah, let me just shoot him a few times. Revenge is especially sweet in Elden Ring. Whoa. Yeah, I'm sure using this um, hammer weapon. It has high damage, but it's rather slow in attack. Oh my god. There's so many of them. Um, let me just run past them. Yep, and grab the item on top. Okay. Uh, right, let me just evade all of them. Yep, no reason for us to fight them all. Oh my. There's so many of them right here. Alright. Um, let me just grab the items real quick. Whoa. <laughs> Alright, just gonna run past all of them. Yep, gonna save myself some extra health plus. Thankfully, their attacks are not that painful though. Yep, that's a good thing. Um, yep, just head in here. Oh, I see a few enemies down there. Yeah, let me just change my weapon. Yeah, the hammer is really slow in attack. Yeah, let me just use the halberd instead. Man, how do I get down from here? Yeah, let me just see if there's any other path. Because 
because that looks like quite a high jump um, yeah I think we have to jump down to that small platform right there on the left yeah I think that's the only way alright hope we don't die for this <laughs> uh, okay we are good Yeah, there's one more item over here. Another misleading message. Yeah, can't seem to write Torrent here. Okay, let me just... Ooh, they are pretty easy. There's an archer right over there. Oh man. Oh, there's two archers. Ooh. Nice. A set of grace. Yep, let's ignore them. Okay, maybe. Okay, maybe let me clear them. So I can get this ghost glove ward. Yeah, the ghost glove ward will be used um, to upgrade um, your ashes of war. Uh, the summons. Yeah. So remember to collect the ghost glove ward. I'm not sure if I pronouncing it correctly. <laughs> okay, let us just reset our flask yep um, took a short break guys yeah it was rather late when I was playing this and I'm back alright so from here um, let us continue on yeah I actually um, changed my weapon to the Scar Sturge Great Sword yeah this is the weapon that General Redan dropped and this weapon is pretty sick yeah let me just showcase to you guys later yeah this weapon is really really strong um, I highly recommend you guys to use this weapon if you are struggling in Elden Ring yeah let me just explore oh hold on <laughs> Is he taunting me? Yeah, he was knocking on his shoe right there. Well, let me just collect the items that I can see. Oh, there's a. Wait, let me get rid of him first. Yeah, so the Star Scourge Great Sword um, is rather slow in attack. Yeah, but it's pretty powerful. Yeah, it has a uh, um, Ashes of War ability. Yeah, let me just show you guys later. Yeah, it's super strong. Oh, there's so many of this oh man I thought I thought the tree will block it <laughs> yeah there's so many of these skeletons right here but they are not that painful so that's good yeah more of this ghost glove what Alright, let us proceed. Um, I'll leave the meter for the last. Yeah, let me just explore the sites first. Ah, this look. Oh, okay. There are two enemies right here. Uh, 
Yeah, the great sword looks really cool. Oh, nice. A love out here. Yep, the great sword has um, splash attack. Yep, pretty strong. Alright, let us proceed here. I see a item inside here. And there's two enemies right here. Let us just sneak attack. Soldier Ashes Looks really cool yeah, It's pretty easy so far Yeah, the skeletons are pretty weak and there's quite a lot of ghost glove ward which is nice yeah so this area is actually um, part of which runny quest line yeah but I'm actually doing the which runny quest line yep hence I'm here So eventually, um, I will do a full run through of the Rich Running Quest line. Yep, I will make a video on the full complete step by step guide. Yep, so if you guys are interested, yep, please support that video. Hmm, doesn't seem to have anything else here. Let me just run through here real quick. Yeah, this pathway. I think they probably have something here. Ah, nice. A level 4 smithing stone. Um, let me just leave him be. <laughs> yep. He doesn't pose any threat. So I'll let him leave. Alright, let me show you guys. Yeah. Yep, so that's the ultimate of this Star Scourge Great Sword. Yep, it is really strong. It has a huge AoE attack, which is pretty useful in Elden Ring. Uh, let me just see what this message say. Yeah, sometimes the message can be pretty interesting um, But not this one <laughs> Alright um, I think we cleared this whole court yet Yep, uh, we came from there Yeah, there was another entrance down Yep, uh, yep, right here. Let us just proceed down. I think there's nothing else in this court yet. 
Man, this looks pretty sus. Oh, there's nothing here. Oh, there's another path. Whoa. What a nice view. Yeah, but I think I saw a boss portal on the right. But before that, let us enjoy this view for a while. Man, look at that. Yep, there's a boss portal right there. And there's two enemies right there. Let me just use my... Alright, never mind. It's pretty weak. Alright. I can't believe there's a boss portal um, so early on. Yeah, I think there's still much to explore in Nocron City. This probably just one of the early mini boss. Hopefully, we don't die that many times. <laughs> yeah, let me just collect the items around here real quick. Ooh, whoa. Yeah, look at that. Yep, so we got ourselves uh, another lava tier. Seems like this place gives quite a lot of lava tier. That's very generous. Yep, lava tier is to um, use to reset our hero attributes for those that are not aware. Yep, once you got a lava tier, you can head back to the. Whoa, is there a giant? Man. That looks really cool. That's probably the final place that we need to reach in Nocron City. That was I was saying. Um, Lava Tear is used to reset our hero's attribute if you want to change to um, another job or respec for another weapon. Yep, you need the Lava Tear. And you can go to the Raya Lucaria um, library where you fight the Queen, the Queen boss. Yep, there you offer the lava tier, and you are able to reset. Yeah, so that's nice. Yeah, lava tier is pretty rare. And all right, I think that's all around here. Whoa, whoa! Oh my God! <laughs> I almost fell to my death. Yep, um, seems like this is the only way through. Which is the... Oh, almost missed this. Nice. Alright. Yeah, I don't think there's any other way. This should be the way that we should proceed to. Which is to defeat this boss gate right here. Alright, let me just prepare myself. Mm. Yep, so just gonna hit in, summon the ashes of war, and hope for the best. <laughs> yeah, still trying to get used to this new weapon the Star Scourge Great Sword. Alright. Huh. I don't see any boss so far. Oh, hold on. Is it this black goo right here? Ooh. Oh my. It just mimic me. <laughs> oh, that's kind of cool. Yep, it's a. Uh, Mimic boss. You just mimic my character. As well as my abilities. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh 
my god. Yeah, almost got destroyed by him. Man. He has my abilities and everything, including health pots. Oh, hold on. I ran out of um, fat points. No, no. Oh man. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> Still trying to get used to the quick sword attacks. Alright, one more hit. Oh my god. Alright, give me one more try. I will make sure I'll be in the next try. Yep, there was a mistake on my end. Man, but that was quite a awesome boss. Yep, it's a mimic boss. Yeah, as I mentioned earlier, uh, let us just run past these guys. Yeah, in this area, we're able to get a Mimic Ashes of War Yep, you'll be one of the loot in this area Alright, let's do this again Yep, same plan uh, By this time round, I'm gonna use the Great Sword Ultimate Attack more often Yep, gonna Make sure my fight points are full. Alright, let's wait for him. Alright, let's go. That's one. That's two. Okay, one more should do the trick. <laughs> nice. Pretty easy. Ooh, we got ourselves another lava tier. Yeah, this this is our third lava tier in this place so far. Yep, pretty generous. That's nice. All right. With that, um, we have defeated this mini boss right here. Let's see if there's anything else. Oh, a card right torrent. Yep, I see a set of grace over here. Huh, that's weird. Can't seem to activate this set of grace. Oh, hold on. Huh. <laughs> Seems like uh, the activation is out of place. Yeah, I'm quite far away from the actual cell of grace. But anyway, yep, you guys saw how powerful um, this great sword is. Yep, highly recommend for you guys to fight and defeat General Redan. Yep, and you'll get this weapon. It is really, really strong. Alright, let us move on. Nice. From here, we are able to ride Torrent. Oh, there's a Crimson Insect right here. Probably one that gives us a new Ashes of War. Yep. Yeah, so you want to quickly oh it's a spinning stone. Yeah you want to quickly um defeat the crimson insect. If not it will actually disappear. Yeah you have to come back again in order for it to reappear back. Yep, so just take note. Okay, let's see what's at the end of this path. Doesn't seem to have 
any enemies right here. Alright. Yeah, we're actually on top of um, Sophia Well. I believe that was the place where we first talked to Blade or Blight for the Witch Runny quest. Yep, so Nocron is actually on top of the Sofra Well area. I'll just try and see if there's any other paths that we can take. Yeah, Elder Ring sometimes have a few secret or hidden paths. Yeah, it seems like um, there's a way forward on the left. Uh, but before that, let me just see what else is there at the end of this bridge. Doesn't seem to have anything. Let me just read the message. I don't believe you're supposed to jump down. <laughs> I might be wrong though. Uh, but for now, let me just proceed to the path that we saw earlier, which is here. Oh, I see an item. But there's a enemy also. Right up ahead. Oh, there's quite a few of them. Yeah, there's quite a lot of these herbs lying around. Let me just collect them. Yeah, there's more of these uh, monoliths where you have to light it up. Yeah, this will unlock um, a mini boss area. Yeah, it's the same as the Sophia well. Yeah, so there's quite a few of these monoliths. Yeah, make sure you light them all. Alright, let me just take a quick look if there's anything in front of here. Yeah, actually I have no idea what this um, spirits is about. Yeah, they seem to be in quite a lot of places. Yeah, some of them um, give items. Yeah, but some of them is just there. <laughs> Let me see if I have any prayer gesture. Who knows? It might unlock um, a secret in Elden Ring. Yep, uh, doesn't seem so. But man, take a look at the background. It's really nice. Alright. Um, let us continue on our adventure. Yeah, whoa. Well, I feel tempted to use my <laughs> great sword ultimate here. Alright, let's do this. Nice. <laughs> All right. Yep. Man. So satisfying to actually have such a powerful um, AOE weapon.
Oh, there's another one of those monoliths. Let us light it up. So this is the second one. Yeah, there's quite a lot of deers here. Yeah, if you want to craft more arrows, um, you can actually kill them all here. Okay, let me just get rid of this archer right here. Monsters here actually do quite a high damage. Oh, there's quite a few of them. Let me just stealth my way. Oh, there's a singing in the background. Oh, there's a monster there near the monolith um, singing. Not too sure what's that about. Yeah, but um, there'll be one of the monoliths that we have to light up. Let me just explore here a little. Yeah, I hear more enemies ahead. Yeah, there's one of more one of those singing. Whoa. There's so many of them inside there. Hmm. Alright, let me just clear this area first. Hopefully. They don't spot me. Oh no. I think one of them spotted me. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of him. Oh, I think the singing gives them a buff. Yeah, they notice there's a aura on their body. Yeah, probably increase certain attributes of them. Oh man. Oh, he just healed. Oh my god. Yeah, I think um, the one that is singing actually provides a healing buff to the rest of the minions. Alright, um, let me just head back there real quick. And get my soul back. And most importantly, to have my revenge. <laughs> yeah, so we should get rid of the singing enemy first. Alright, see my soul right here. Oh, hold on. There's a cell of grace here. Nice. Man, almost missed this. <laughs> yep, so guys, um, sorry for the weird cut. Did some research, and this is actually um, another secret area in Nokron Eternal City. Yeah, this is actually the way to actually get our Mimic Ashes of War. Yep, so let me just show you guys. Um, yeah, we'll come back to. Um, the other area earlier but for now let us proceed to get our mimic ashes of war first yeah so from here you want to jump down yeah this is actually my first time um doing this yeah so <laughs> hopefully it goes well yeah and from here I believe we have to 
come to this path yep let's just figure it out as we go all right seems like we got ourselves another rune up and hmm i wonder if we can jump here oh, never mind. let's stay on the main course Ooh, there's one of those um mimic, mimic monsters oh i really hope i don't die here <laughs> oh my god Oh man. Yep, um hey guys. Yep, fell to my death quite a few times over here. As well as got killed by these um mimic monsters. They're actually pretty strong. Yeah the they have quite a high damage, so just take note to we'll kill them fast. Yeah, as you can see I'm showing them no mercy <laughs> all right yep with that let's continue on hmm oh there's a path right here I believe we have to jump down. Oh, look. We're actually pretty near the giant statue that we saw earlier. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so um, the Mimic Ashes of War is right inside this cathedral. At least that was what I read. <laughs> yeah, let us find out. Yeah, but um, what I read was it should be inside this cathedral right here, somewhere. Yep. So let us explore. I hear another crimson insect. Oh, it's a. Health plus crimson insect. All right, this should be the place. Nice. Oh, there's another item here. Oh, whoa <laughs> man I didn't even notice this enemy right here I thought it was a statue of some sort whoa that was a close one yeah I thought it was a statue yep all right orange color item which is legendary Alright guys, so this is um, the path that you should follow to get the Mimic Tear Ashes which is, I believe, um, one of the top um, Ashes of War in this game It got nerfed recently, but uh, from what I hear, it's still very strong Yeah, so highly recommended to take this path that I just took Yep. From here, since we are here, let us continue to explore. Yeah, we'll head back um, to the area with the seeing monsters later on. Yeah, we can always teleport back to the set of grace. So for now, let us just venture here. Alright, seems like heading down this. Ladder is the only way to go, and there are 
quite a few monsters down here. Alright, let us just stealth and step in from the back. Nice. Oh, whoa. What in the... <laughs> what? Oh man, I'm stuck by the rolling ball. Man, the rolling ball is moving by itself. Ooh, another lava tear. Sweet. Yeah, this place is very generous in terms of lava tear. Excellent. This way we can explore different type of builds as well as equipments. Yeah, I didn't expect the ball in the middle to be one of our enemy yeah i thought it was just a decoration but oh wells um whoa oh nice a set of grace yeah it seems like it's quite a lot of those mimic monsters right up ahead um let's just Reset our flask. Yep, and let's use our mimic tear ashes that we just got. Yeah, I want to test how powerful this is. <laughs> yeah, so the mimic tear ashes will work exactly as like the mini boss that we fought earlier it should duplicate an exact copy of me but take note um, you'll eat up a big portion of your health so remember to heal after you summon the mini tear ashes nice As you can see you can use um, all the skills that we have let me just run up ahead Clear this bunch over here while he clear the back. Oh man, my image of war is pretty weak right now because I believe um, it's only level 1. Yeah, you'll get stronger as you level up. The ashes of war. And here we are. Yep, this is the giant that we saw afar. Yep, and we are right here. Man, it looks really cool. But um, please don't tell me we need to fight him. Whoa. Whoa. This wasn't what I was expecting. Yeah, one of these. Oh man. These giants that we saw in the early part of the game. Oh my god. Almost dead. Yep, um, sorry guys, <laughs> trying to concentrate on this fight. Let me just hide here.
Yeah, and just take note that the ultimate of Trusted Great Sword can be disabled by opponent heavy attack. Yep, so it's not a 100% success rate. Oh, do you see that? It just knocked back itself. Oh my god. Alright, he's almost dead. Nice. Man, I hope we don't have to fight this giant next. Pretty safe so far. <laughs> Um, let me just see if there's anything else here. Oh, there's one of those magical portal. Um, but before that, let us head inside. Ooh, I see a chest. And a legendary item. Finger Slayer Blade. Oh yes. Um guys, so as I'm following the Witch Runny quest line, um Finger Slayer Blade is one of the items that we have to get for Witch Runny. Yep, so nice. Um I got the Finger Slayer Blade. But um before I return back to Wish Rani, let me just finish up um, Nocron Eternal City. Yep, because this is what this video is about. Yeah, for the Wish Rani questline, um, I'll be making a separate video. Yep, so please support. <laughs> there are many steps in the questline. I hope you guys find it helpful. Alright, um, looks like the magical portal teleported us back from where we um, stop at. Pretty convenient. Alright, let's get rid of this singing monster first. Out of the way, the rest should be rather easy to destroy. Yep, and let's light up this monolith. This will be the third one. Not too sure how many monoliths are there in total, but um, this is our third one so far. Let's grab the items over here yeah I'm actually keeping my eye out on where the rest of the monolith monoliths might be yeah seems like we have to get rid of this area next that seems to be Man, there seems to have a horde of monster inside here. But perfect for our Star Scourge Great Sword to use our Star Caller Cry. Okay, let me just go in. Nice. Man, I'm loving this weapon more and more. 
Look how strong it is. Oh, a shining horn headband. Let me just try this on. Cool. It's one of those headbands that the monsters are wearing. We have the Christmas vibes. Yeah, so um, this um, horn creature body in the ground after we light up all the monoliths yeah it will trigger um, a message to say that I uh, can't recall what the message is yeah but um, you'll be able to progress to a boss area yeah this should be the same um, mechanics as of the Sophia River quest yeah so let us hunt for the rest of the monoliths so this will be our fifth one yeah we just activated one near the horde of monsters earlier man I hate these red monsters they are pretty painful so <laughs> um, don't underestimate the rats yeah I got killed by them quite a few times in the past alright so this is our fifth one seems like there's this secret area right there but um, I'll explore that in my own time yeah for now let's find the rest of the monoliths oh there's one more here and it's unguarded there's no monsters nice oh hold on oh there's a oh man he just spotted me yeah one of those um strong wolf boss yep not gonna fight that <laughs> yeah it's rather difficult to defeat yeah I actually fought one of those before I think it was near the um Raya Lucaria castle can't recall or was it stop view yeah but um seems like we are still missing a few more monoliths um, in total we have activated 6 I just see if there's any I mean let's find the rest of them yeah I see another pathway there there should be a monolith right there because the rest of the area we have already explored yep only left with this one let me see if I can stealth my way up alright let's just get rid of them wrong it wasn't the corpse earlier that we saw it was this one whoa 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 man what a irritating um monster <laughs> glad it's dead yep so seems like is a total of six monoliths. Yep, and you unlock this. If you interact with it, you teleport us, which I believe um, will be to the boss area. 
yep here we are yeah so a total of six monoliths to unlock this boss area all right um hopefully we can slain this boss this boss on our first try <laughs> okay let's summon our mimic it's just a four heal up Ooh, it's a it's an antler boss Just did a double star collar cry. Whoa, where did he go? Oh man, seems like he can um, teleport. say that this um, animation is looking pretty good away itself. Whoa, he just recovered. My god. Man, he just recovered a big portion of his health. That's cheating. Alright. Left a few plus. But man, look how pretty this fight is. As well as the soundtrack. Yeah, this is one of the things that I like about Elden Ring. Man, that was a close one. Yeah, in Elden Ring, boss fights are really entertaining. Alright, it's almost dead. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Let's do this. Come on. Nice. Yep, just one more. Whoa. Let's go for attack will do. Yeah, let's hit it before he disappear again. Nice. On our first try. Remembrance of the regal ancestors. Alright. <laughs> Yeah, didn't expect myself um, to clear this boss on my first try. Alright, um, with that, we have cleared this mini boss in this area. Um, let me just see 
if there's anything else. Alright, let's us um, exit this area. I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, so um, there's still another area in Nokro Internal City, uh, which is to the ancestral woods, South Greece. Yep, from here, I found out that I actually missed out another area. Yeah, let me just show it to you guys. Yeah, so Nokro City is pretty huge. But um, we are almost to the end. Yeah, just one more area to go. Yeah, so just um. Oh, hold on. I think. No, no, I don't think this is the area. <laughs> uh, hold on. Let me figure this out. Yeah, it's the area with the bright jellyfish. That I believe I saw earlier. Yeah, I'm pretty bad. Alright, nice. Yep, this is it. Yeah, I'm pretty bad with directions. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, there's one more area here we have yet to explore. Let me just head up. Oh, there's a bunch of jellyfish. Time for our star collar cry. Man, this never gets old. So satisfying. <laughs> This will be the secret path. Another secret path in Nokon City. Um, but before that, let me just take a quick look if there's anything here. Oh, oh, there's an item there. Oh, almost missed this. A motto necklace. Alright. Let's head back. Mm, yeah, I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, that was where we were earlier. Alright. Um, let us proceed on to this secret path right here. Yep, so... Ooh, nice. Another stone sword key. Yeah, I seem to have a cave right ahead. And more of those jellyfish monsters yeah the jellyfish monsters are pretty easy to kill yeah I have no idea what happened if they turn red Yeah, but I'm um, not gonna wait to find out. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Another set of grease. Yep, so this is the final area in Nokron Eternal City. 
let us reset and continue on yeah I already hear a knight walking around man this don't sound good oh boy yeah I think um, there's a strong knight ahead ah oh man it's one of those yeah, yeah I fought um, this knight before it's super difficult <laughs> to defeat because of his because of the shield that he's holding yeah most of your physical attacks um, won't be able to damage him much because of the shield oh this is gonna be tough alright let me see if I can damage him by shooting afar oh man that is such a <laughs> low damage <laughs> yeah I didn't really upgrade my bow hence the um, very low damage yeah at this rate I think I need to shoot a couple hundreds of <laughs> arrows to defeat him hmm. but let me just try to cut away um, as much health as possible Man, it's gonna take forever. All right, let me let me just head down and fight him. Hopefully, um, the star collar cry is able to. Um, deal damage past his shield yeah I want to lure him behind this wall so the plan is um, hold on let me just shoot another arrow Yeah, the idea is to get him to stay behind this wall and then I'll use my um, star collar cry and hopefully damage him and hopefully his reach is unable to hit me past this wall Yeah, call for the... because the star collar cry is quite a big win Ooh, nice! This, this knight right here is pretty sick. Yup, guys, um, gonna take a few tries. Yup, so um, this is um, one of the moments where I actually defeated him. Yup, uh, I actually fought him quite a few times. So. Hopefully, this will be the one fight that I managed to defeat him. And so the plan remains the same. I'm going to use the wall to my advantage. Yep, but um, 
I'm going to try to position myself in a way where I'll be slightly further from him so that the attacks um, across the wall won't be able to hit me and then I'll just star caller cry my way through yep so I'm gonna head over here aggro him with arrows yep um, then he will come over here yep so come on alright yep so keep a distance from him you'll be somewhat stuck over here yep at this angle right here nice <laughs> man you guys ooh a crucible horn shield excellent yep you guys have no idea <laughs> how many times um, I've tried to defeat him Yep, um, struggled quite a lot But, yep, that's the way um, That's how I do it You can use that particular angle To actually create a distance Between um, the knight and yourself And then his attacks um, Won't be able to reach you And if you're using a, If you're using the Star Scourge Great Sword like me Yep, with a huge AoE, you can actually just burst him down. Alright, nice. Okay, with that, um, let's proceed on with this main path over here. Oh, I right hear another one of those crimson insect. Yeah, it's right opposite. Oh man Yeah, it's one of those Oh man It's another <laughs> strong knight That we have to fight um, Let me just see if there's anything else over here Yep, um, <laughs> trying to see if there's any hidden path Alright, the good thing is the knight is not facing inwards so we can actually choose not to fight him Yeah, but um, I think I still want to try um, to defeat him Alright <laughs> Hope I don't regret this Okay, that was a mistake. Um, let me just try this again. Yeah, so the Star Color Cry have his disadvantages. Yeah, when you do the Star Color Cry, it can actually move. Yeah, so enemies can actually attack you while we are just standing there. Yeah, the good thing is we are pretty near. To where we died earlier So let's Run back there Yep, I'm still gonna try To defeat the knight here Yeah, but this time round I'm gonna 
aggro him over and try to use the walls to my advantage like I did earlier oh no this is a mistake alright let me get my soul back oh no there are some of these little minions right here let me just carry out them first seems like the knight is still stuck right here alright to block his flying attacks nice nice oh no run 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 yeah so when the knight reach half health he will start uh, executing these heavy attacks yep so we will want to dodge them because it's rather painful alright he's He's quite low in health. I think one more star caller should do the trick. Come on! Oh no! Nice! <laughs> Man. Man, this feels so good. Yep, uh, I hate this. Nice the most. <laughs> they are pretty challenging. They're almost a they're almost a boss, you know. It takes great effort to actually defeat them. Right? Um since there's a main path here, but before that, um let us take this path right here. It should lead us to the crimson insect that we saw earlier. Yeah, so the, the knights are actually quite common in Lindell Royal Capital. Yeah, if you guys have really been there, yeah, there's quite a few of those knights. So, hence I know how strong they are. Alright, let's get this instant insect right here. Nice. I believe that's a incantation. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Man, I almost... Ooh, there's an item right here. Okay. Doesn't seem to have anything else. Let us um, head back to the mid path. Oh, hold on. Oh, I see an item right there. Nice. Almost missed this. <laughs> yeah, I'm so afraid that I accidentally jump down. <laughs> yeah, that would suck. Okay, um, let us head back to the mid path. Yeah, I believe we are near to the end of Nokron Eternal City. Nice, I see another item ahead. Oh, there are enemies hidden right inside the waterfall.
Let me just stealth my way through. Yeah, so highly recommend um, to clear knock on Eternal City. Yeah, I think so far we got three to four lava tier as well as um, I think about three rune up. Yeah, so the rewards here are pretty sweet. Yeah, it's really worth it to explore this city right here. Oh no, I think I I got the other monsters here. Yeah, I like how they try to <laughs> um, taunt us by slamming their shield. Yeah, it's kind of adorable. Yeah, the view is really beautiful. Oh, who's this? We got ourselves a new gesture. Um, let me see if by talking to him multiple times, will this trigger um, any new mechanics? <laughs> Alright, uh, doesn't seem so. Yep, mm, doesn't seem to trigger anything. Yeah, so guys, um, we have reached the end. Yep, this is actually the final boss in Noko Internal City, and they are rather challenging. Yeah, I couldn't actually defeat them as of now, but I'll come back here again. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video so far, and hope you guys find it helpful. Yep. Um, there are other videos in my channel on Elden Ring. Yeah, please um, check them out if you're interested. And please like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. Yeah, uh, with that, stay safe everyone. Take care and hope to see you at my next video. Alright, bye.